Hi everyone, this is Lorraine. Um, today I'm here on a Friday uh, again, which I'm going to continue to do. Um, but I thought I'd go and create my project operation, get sexy again. You know, sometimes you try and you try and try and you don't succeed and now it's time to succeed. 23 is one of my favorite numbers, so it must be my year. You know what I'm saying? It must be good. So this year I need to get fit finally. That's my goal. I need to get fit finally. And getting fit is going to require a little bit of work. It's not as cold today. However, the problem today is that two of my three children stayed home with a stomach bug. So we're not leaving the house today. Only, only going to pick up my other child from school when he's done. Uh, but two of the three are down for the count right now. So none of my exercising can happen. Um, well, actually it can maybe tonight. I'll, I'll go on the treadmill and I can still go on the treadmill today. Let's gonna, let, at least one time, we're gonna try to do one time on the treadmill today. Um, I personally really like to work out in the morning, but it had been too cold to get out of bed. So I'm just gonna set some goals now. Um, I need to get back to walking in the morning. I used to get up, I have a treadmill, I have a Nordic track um, X22 I, which is like the high incline one because I like to walk on an incline. Haven't done it in a little bit because it's been too cold for me in the morning. And I've frankly just been lazy and I haven't gotten the motivation. And so I'm gonna set the goal now to get back on the treadmill. I like to get up 5 a.m., basically go on the treadmill and then um, usually at nighttime go on the treadmill again. So starting tonight, that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna start tonight. Um, and officially starting on Saturday, treadmill morning and night at least 30 to 45 minutes. And what I like to do on the treadmill is I don't like to run. I'm not a runner. I've never been able to run. Um, that's why I like the high incline one. I start at the five incline and mine goes all the way up. I'm not sure how high it goes, but I, I get to about 20 because you know, I'm new to this. I'm new. Um, so I go basically like a little bit on each one till I get to 20 and then I come back down and that's my 30 minutes. But so I need to get back into that routine. I'm gonna get back into that. And then uh, maybe I can go push myself to go a little bit higher and a little bit faster. Cause I usually go at about a three speed, um, but it's nice. It's just, I like that walk. And then I need to start walking outside at least when the kids are not home or if they're home, as long as they're well to go for like nice walks. I'd really like to start, um, going on a little walk with all the kids at nighttime. So maybe I could get that in by next Friday and then I can discuss that with you. Uh, you know, all the good stuff. That's about as it as far as exercise goal that I'm gonna set for myself is just start getting back into moving and walking again. Um, so at least do the treadmill two times a day, morning, night, and then I'll try to do some kind of walk outside. I like, cause lucky enough for me, I live in Florida and it's a beautiful place. Um, wouldn't want to live anywhere else. And, um, I will never live anywhere else. I don't think, I don't think probably not, but I probably will never live anywhere else. So that's my, my goal. Um, I'm going to just incorporate a lot of fruit in my, my diet because I do well with fruit. Um, I'm just gonna try to eliminate all the bad stuff. I'm gonna go full force into this and just not eat processed things, um, maybe except on the weekend, like when we go out to dinner. We usually go to dinner, at least on the weekend, um, you know, and we have our routine because routine person. But I'm gonna try to eliminate a lot of the processed things. Um, so I really would like to get down to basics like and I say fruititarian and I'm not even like kidding, like because like fruit is down to the basics. My body does well when I eat fruit. Um, my body does well when I eat nuts. Some vegetables irritate my system. Um, and I think meat makes my fingers swell up for some reason. I don't know. Um, I don't know what the cause of that. It might just be the seasoning or maybe it's like how they process meats and stuff, but I, I just need to, um, lay off all that kind of stuff. So those are probably the two goals that I'm gonna have for this week. 
Um, and then I probably will add a fitness kind of thing in there. I really like Pure Bar. I also like yoga. And be Pure Bar again or maybe yoga. So that might be my goal for the following week, but I just gotta get back into the routine of getting up early, going on the treadmill, and all that fun stuff. I have it, I gotta use it. And I really like having my treadmill, I really, really do. So um, it's in our garage, and our garage kinda looks like a dungeon, but you know, it is what it is for now. Uh, I just wanted to also mention from my last haul video, I'm using all the makeup. I'm using all the makeup that I purchased and I really like it. I like the eyeshadow palette so far. Um, I did mix it up with something else. Uh, so I didn't use it solely, but that's okay. And then I used that um, Charlotte Tilbury like cream bronzer and with that Rare Beauty brush. And I really like that Rare Beauty brush and I used that Rare Beauty um, blush and so that's what I did and I I'm kind of happy with it. I feel like So far so good. So I didn't get a chance to use the iPads or anything, but That's okay. I'm getting out somewhere and going beyond so that's what I'm gonna try to do this week um, And then I will film other videos. I'm gonna try to do at least another video Per week like at least do try to do two. Do I'll do Fridays. I'll continue to do Fridays um, but my goal right now is to get fit um, and God, wear workout clothes every day. Might as well. So today I wore this, um, oh, you can't even see my whole body. This little t-shirt that actually is ripped. I noticed I had to go to the school today. Um, and so I probably wouldn't have even worn. Oh, you want to see? You guys um, may or may not follow me on Instagram. Um, and if you watched my videos for a long time, you knew that I had a puppy named Clyde and I loved him so much. <laughs> Can't talk about it. Really hard for me to talk about him. But I still miss him so much. <laughs> and we got, um, we got Cosmo and I love Cosmo too. <laughs> He's part of our family now. Uh, but I love him too. But um, and then we have Anya. Um, we have three dogs right now and they're all fairly young dogs because you know, as your dogs get older, they all kind of um, pass away and it's really sad. But um, Clyde, Clyde passed away because he had, um, he, he had, I, I'm not 100% sure if it was kidney or liver cancer. I can't remember exactly, but he actually just passed away in his, um, in Brian's arms and his sleep and everything. So it wasn't like, we didn't have to make any difficult decisions. It just is what it is. So it was very sad, but um, it just was sad. But anyway, don't want to talk about sad stuff. Um, this is Cosmo. I couldn't live without a little guy in my life. And I wanted, um, I didn't want to, I didn't want to replace Clyde, but I love Pomeranians. And I didn't want to get like, I got kind of the same similar coloring. Uh, <laughs> I got one that's similar coloring, but not the same. So the same, but different. Um, and it's nice because, you know, when you get a certain breed, <laughs> there's, I love to like, one day, one day we will adopt dogs that are older. That's my goal. But when my children are young, you don't know what a dog has been through. So I really just don't, I'm not there where I feel comfortable having um, a dog that's not, that I don't know what it's been through in its life and what struggles it's had. Um, so right now we have puppies and by the time these puppies um, are all older or pass, um, because dogs don't have a long life, so you just have to give them the best life while they're there with you. Um, but by that time, we'll be able to adopt some senior dogs and I would really like to do that. But anyway, this is Cosmo. And I love Cosmo, he's such a good boy. Um, but the nice thing about when you do get a dog that is a certain breed, um, I will say, is that they will have similar personality traits. They won't be exactly the same, but they do like just, just certain movements or um, certain sounds uh, that are the same. But this is Cosmo, he's very cute. He just got a haircut. Say hi. You say hi? 
He's really sweet. So that was my little introduction to my puppy dog. Still makes me sad, so obviously. Probably all red, because that's what happens to me. I get these rashes. Anyway, but let me show you my body now. Um, I don't think you can see my whole body. I don't know how to do it in a way that you'll be able to see the whole thing. Um, I gotta just back up more. Can you kind of see? Kind of see. Uh, but this, I'll take out my shirt. I wore the shirt today. I wore, I wore the shirt today. I'll try to do something better uh, probably next week. We'll figure it out. Maybe I'll even go outside. Who cares? Uh, but I, this is a set by Beyond Yoga, which I love. But I wore the shirt today because I had to go um, to my older son's school because of, I participate. <laughs> I participate. And I needed to, you know, be uh, just dress a little bit more. I don't, I don't care when I go to pick up the kids. Um, I'll typically try to wear. Ta-da! I'm not in the best shape, but I'm not in the shape that I hate. Um, the shirt, and I realized after I wore the shirt that it has like a big rip in it and some holes on the back. And I'm like, should I throw it away or do I keep it? Um, but it's fine. But I like these bras from Beyond Yoga a lot. So that's like my style. But this is like a complete jumble of a video. Um, I didn't lose 10 pounds this week. I did lose a couple though, because I've been very conscious of um, what I've been eating and um, drinking and just, I wanna continue on that journey, but um, you know, figure it out a little bit better. I'll say that one of my goals probably this year is to get fit enough that um, I can get a boob job. So that is one of my goals because one of my boobs, this one is much smaller than this one and it doesn't make me happy. So gotta get some boobies in there. This is kind of a jumble of a video. So if you have any questions, feel free to post them below. If you have any comments, feel free to post them below. Um, I was happy to see that everyone approved of the quality and they even I had some people say that the quality from the first two were not bad So I was happy to hear that because I watched them and I thought oh they look fine So I don't know it could have just been it is what it is But I tried to upload it in the best quality that I could this past time um, and that's what I'll do today as well, but I just thought the route that said like YouTube specific was like a good one, but maybe it wasn't for everybody. So who knows, but um, I'll be back. If you have any suggestions, I'll probably do a little what's in my purse video. However, I have like, I, it's not as exciting anymore. I don't carry around a bunch of stuff. It just, it's just not as exciting, but I do enjoy a what's in my purse video. It's interesting to see what people have because something to me that's just like normal and common and good um maybe is something that you never even thought of and you're like oh like i want to do that um like the other day i watched somebody and i haven't watched a youtube video in a long time just that's just where i'm at but she applied the cheek color like a little bit higher on the cheek and i'm like i like that so that's what i've been doing the last couple days um when i have applied makeup which like I said, it's not every day, but today I did it, and then the last video I did it, and I enjoyed it. I don't know. I don't know if you can tell a difference or not, but I lifted it just like a little bit. So that's it for now, but hey, we'll see you next week at some, at two points, two points. But um, I would like to do a little video with questions if you have questions for me, um, but that's it.